Hello gang, it's the Pick Maniac here with a demonstration of the SN Exerciser. This is kind of a cool circuit. It uses a pick over here to control the SN76477 complex noise chip. Well, um, boy, this could go on forever. It does a million different things, but let me give you just a, a quick overview of, of what it can do. First of all, there's a VCO, and um, when I push this button here, it'll trigger it. Now you can hear that it has an attack and a decay. And the attack is set by this pot, so this will be a very slow. Very slow attack, and this one sets the decay, so... Very slow decay. Let's put it at the fastest attack. Okay, now there's also an LFO. And let's hear what that is. That'll go all the way down to sub audio. But here, I've got it in the audio range. And since it's a, an LFO, it'll go down into the sub-audio. And of course, the reason for that is wanting to modulate the, the VCO. So we'll turn on the modulation. pretty crazy sounds. Okay, so the attack and DK, and then the FM modulation, the um, LFO and the VCO pitch control. Um, now the one thing we have, well let's let's take a look at the noise source. Now the noise source has a very broad range of sounds. This control over here um, sets the, the clock rate for the, for the noise source. And this control over here is the low pass filter for it. That's about as low as you can get, sub-audio. So once again, we've got three switches here. One for the VCO, one for the LFO, one for the noise source. Let's go back to the VCO. Now the one thing that we haven't seen yet is repetition mode. So right now, you get just a single sound. Let's turn the DK down a little bit. But if I go ahead and flip this switch, we get a repetitive mode. Yeah, let's see, we need a shorter DK. And the repetition rate is set by this control over here. And you'll note that it's gated, so this control here is going to set the, the gate time, so what we would normally call the sustain.
and so forth. Um, oh yeah, one, one other thing that we haven't seen yet is uh, this little switch here lets you determine the, the pulse width for the VCO. You can either have it at 20% or 50%. Let's hear the difference. Okay, that's 50%. There's 20%, considerably more harmonics. Once again, 20%, 50%. And the final control is the volume control over here. Now that's just a brief sample of the sounds you can make. I mean, it's really a crazy circuit. It'll do a lot, a lot of things. Oh, and I guess one final thing is you can um, set it so it's just on all the time. So a locked mode. Okay, I think that'll do it. So once again, a demonstration of the SN Exerciser, kind of a neat circuit using a pick and the SN76477 chip. See you later.